humanity. I love you all with all my heart, with all my might. I'm so raw ray. My videos are about love, infinity, creation, energy, because we're infinite love, infinite energy, infinite creation. This is who we are. We are the human race. We live to love and we love to live. Primordial instinct is the heartbeat, pulse of life, the pulse of creation, who we are. The highest energy of creation is that of the human heart. Our heart. The heartbeat. Okay. So, let's talk about this video. It's an infinite virtual cycle. As all virtual cycles, they're infinite in nature. This one is a beautiful one. It's a beautiful one. And it's this infinite virtual cycle between sowing and reaping. Sow and reap. Right? It's this infinite virtual cycle that our planet Mother Earth allows us to engage in because of the soil, because of these ecosystems that we have created. Because this planet, we manufacture this planet. Our species manufacture this planet. And this is something that we all need to come to terms with. All the information has been provided. You need to open your eyes, stare at the sun, love with the energy of your heart, which is the highest energy of creation, and tap into your DNA memories. Love is the key that unlocks your DNA memories. And understand who we are as a species. We're this amazing, incredible species. This is who we are. We are the human race. This is who we are. Okay. So, because of the soil, we have the ability to grow crops. Sowing. And then we reap our fruit. This is what we do. We reap our fruits, don't we? Our crops. This is what we do. And this idea has evolved into something beyond agrarian societies. Into a modern day civilization that we are today. Planet Earth. Who we are as a species. And this is very straightforward. It's cause and effect. Cause and effect. This is what it is. It's this idea that you reap what you sow. And then you sow what you reap. Because this is the nature of this system, of this planet that we have manufactured ourselves, that we have built with our spherical technologies. You see, it's a cause and effect. This infinite virtual cycle of creation. Who we are as a species. And it starts with this idea of the seed of life. Us, the human race, the apple orb, the epicenter of the apple contains the seed, seed of life, that allows for those seeds to be planted so, so they can be reaped in the way of fruit, apple trees. And the apple tree is the perfect example of what this means. Because of the apple orb is the electromagnetic field of creation, the human heart. The sun's electromagnetic field, the universe's electromagnetic field, the earth's electromagnetic field, all the electromagnetic fields of creation. And the apple is this fruit that gives us that meaning. And at the epicenter of it is the seed of life, us. And the electromagnetic field of the universe, the central sun gives life, which is us. You see, it's a perfect, perfect, perfect example of sowing and reaping. The apple, and what the apple means is the perfect fruit. Is the perfect fruit because within it is the seed that allows more fruit to grow in more trees. So you gotta sow those seeds, meaning you gotta plant them seeds. You gotta plant the seeds. And what is this idea? Well, this idea is consciousness, is self awareness, is love, is humanity, is who we are, subjective reality, is truth. We are the epicenter of the universe. 
And this is who we are. This is our species. We are the epicenter of the universe. This is who we are. This is our species. We are the human species. We live to love and we love to live. You see, the apple is a perfect example. The seed of life. And then what else is the seed of life? Well, us. Our DNA. The sperm and the egg coming together as one. And creating life. The human life, who we are. Infinite eternal creators, co-creators of infinite eternities, who we are, the human race, compasses and sandals. Identity and true self, time and energy. Action. Why, how? Flow, true north and destination. We stare at the sun, we open our eyes, open our hearts, open our mind and open the portal and build the bridge to infinity. We evolve. All this energy comes within us. So we evolve into infinity, who we are, the human race. Who we are, the human race. This is who we are. You see, sowing, sowing. Because you need them seeds to sow, don't you? Consciousness, that's why you plant seeds. You plant love in soil fertile. Fertile soils. This is what we do, our love, our actions, our deeds, purposeful daily action. This is what we saw. We saw this, we saw that, sowing that. This is what we saw. We saw our actions, cause and effect. We are that. It's this ancient idea of fruit of thy labor. Is your actions. Is what you do with the actions that you take that matters. Because in the beginning, if you don't have any seeds to plant, you need to find the seeds. And where are those seeds? Well, those seeds are in nature. Our beautiful planet, our garden, Mother Earth. So, if we understand this notion, then we seek that we seek the seed, meaning life, seed of life, creation itself, knowledge, wisdom. And then we obtain the seeds and then we can eat the fruit or the vegetable, whatever. And then we plant that seed, we sow it. So then we reap our crops as a result of that. You see, this is infinite virtual cycle of life. Who we are. And everything because of our actions, our consciousness, our self-awareness. Who we are as a species. The human race. Who we are as a species. So this infinite virtual cycle of sowing and reaping. So you see, in the end, you end up sowing what you reap. Whether by gathering it if you don't have the seeds in the first place or by having then once you have those seeds you sow them because you reaped that that you gathered and then this notion is an infinite virtual cycle because then those seeds becomes your next action and then with those seeds you you sow them seeds and then eventually you're going to reap the results. You're going to reap the crops, the fruit of thy labor, your actions, your purposeful daily action with the love of your heart. Because it's the highest energy of creation. It's who we are as a species. And then what happens? Well, we, what do we sow after that? Well, we sow what we reap. Because our, our reap is what gives us these new seeds. And then we use those seeds to sow again and to plant new seeds new consciousness new love new self-awareness who we are as a species who we are as a species who we are infinite eternal creators co-creators of infinite eternities us the human race who we are an incredible species we live to love and we love to live we are the human race 
This is who we are with the highest energy of creation. We are the creators ourselves. We are the prime movers. This is who we are. We are the prime movers. So understanding this foundational knowledge is what allows us to build incredible foundations. The human race, the Republic of Planet Earth, who we are, the citizenry of the Republic of Planet Earth, all of us here in our planet that we created ourselves because we are the DNA of infinity. We are the epicenter of the universe. Our central sun is the central sun of everything that there is and would always be the cosmos. And we are the seed of life that originated from the planet that we created ourselves with our technologies, our spherical technologies. We are the human race. This is who we are. For infinite love, infinite energy, infinite creation. This is who we are. We are the human race. So this idea is fundamental. Sowing and reaping. Because in the end, sowing leads to reaping and reaping leads to more sowing. Cause and effect. It's an infinite virtuous cycle of its own. It's understanding who we are. The epicenter, the seed of life, creation itself. This is who we are. We are the creator. Creator creates creations and creation creates creator. This is an infinite virtuous cycle. And we are precisely these. We are the human race. This is who we are. We are the most evolved, the most advanced, the most technologically developed species. We're the most ancient species because we are the first species in our cosmos. This is who we are. We are the human race. This is who we are. We are the human race. You see? And now we can understand this notion of who we are. And as a republic go around the infinite number of universes that we have created with our consciousness and self-awareness and plant our seeds of knowledge, plant our seeds of wisdom, create planets just like this planet that we have created and inhabit those planets in the orbit of the central suns of each of those universes that we have created ourselves with our consciousness and self-awareness and inhabit them with our planets that we manufacture with our own spherical technology contained within our DNA. In order for us to access our technologies, we need to love with the energy of our hearts, the highest energy of creation, and stare at the sun and use that energy to channel us. We channel that energy of love and we manifest with our consciousness of awareness of spherical technology that allowed us to create everything that we have created in the first place to become who we are, the creators. Because this is what we're reaping. These are the effects of our actions. Our actions are infinite because we are infinite. We're planting our seeds. And our seeds are those of love. Those of consciousness. Those of self-awareness. Those of creation. This is who we are. We are the human race. This is our purpose. We live to love and we love to live. And to live is to love. It's the highest energy of creation. We are the human DNA. We are the DNA of infinity. This is who we are. We have infinite infinity within us because we are infinity ourselves. We are the prime movers. This is who we are as a species. We are the prime movers. So, sowing everywhere this is our purpose as a species we are the republic of planet earth this is who we are and we create planets orbiting the central suns of all the universes that exist ones that we have created and those that came before us and those that have been created after us that we didn't create them necessarily but were created nonetheless and we inhabit those planets that we create ourselves, orbiting the central suns. And we can do this to infinity and from there, share our knowledge, our wisdom, our inf infinite nature to everything that there is. 
in the cosmos and all the other infinities that exist. All these infinities that exist, all of them, because we're part of it, we're one with it, we are it, we are the creators ourselves, we're the prime movers. This is who we are. And because this is who we are as a species, it is our purpose to do so, to create with our time, our energy, which is infinite in nature, because we are infinite. Our identity and true self, a human heart, be the pulse of life, the pulse of creation. Our actions. Why, how, flow, true north and destination. Everything that we do has to be purposeful with the energy of love, purposeful love, and create. And we go and create. Plant the seeds. Sowing infinite creation, infinite love, infinite energy across everything that there is in reality. And we reap the benefits of that, of the seed of life, the seed of creation. And we do this to infinity because this is who we are. We are infinity ourselves. We're the biological expression of infinity. We are the consciousness and self-awareness of infinity. This is who we are. This is who we are. Our species is the biological mechanism of infinity itself, the creator, because we are it at the biological scale. Our consciousness and self-awareness allow us to understand what created us in the first place, which is the central sun of our universe. And we ourselves can replicate that by creating central suns ourselves with the technologies that we have encoded in our DNA because we are it. And that's why we are the prime movers. The human heartbeat, the pulse of life, the pulse of creation, who we are, base infinity. This is who we are, base infinity. We're the human race, we're the republic of planet Earth. Infinity equals zero, and we are infinity ourselves. We're the prime movers, all of us. If you're a human, you have a heart. If you have a heart, you are a prime mover. You're an infinite eternal creator. This is who you are. This is your nature. This is your destiny. You were purposefully created by our DNA to do just that. To be a compass. To have an identity and a true self and free will. So you choose your own creations with your purposeful daily action. You have agency. All of us do. This is who we are. This is our species. We sundowns. We stare at the sun. We open the portal. We build the bridge, meaning we evolve into infinity. The energy of the sun comes into our bodies and supercharges the cells with gamma rays and all sorts of rays and allows us to evolve so we can love more and be more conscious and tap into our DNA memories because love is the key that unlocks the DNA structure. So we can regain knowledge of who we are the most ancient species, the central species, the first species, sun suns. This is who we are, we're sun sun. We're sun suns, this is who we are, the sun of suns. This is who we are, the first sun, the central sun, the, the sun of suns, our sun. And we are the children of our sun. We're sun suns ourselves. All of us. This is who we are. Infinite eternal creators as a species. All of us are these. All of us, the whole species. This is what we have evolved into. This is our nature. This is our biology. As I said, we are the biology of infinity, which makes us the consciousness and self-awareness of infinity itself, which is creation, which is us, the creator. Because we understand the principles, prime mover. We have the mathematical proofs of everything. So we can create ourselves. Because this is what we do. We are here to create. Not only biological life, the seed of life, with sperm and egg. Our children, our offsprings, because we're all children. Remember. we all children. So what does that mean? Well, that means that we're not only here to reproduce. Right? Spreading the seed of life. But we're also here to create other things outside the ourselves. We're here also to create 
an infinite number of realities with our consciousness and self-awareness because we are ourselves infinity. So we, with our consciousness and self-awareness, can create an infinite number of universes with central suns because this is who we are, this is our species, and this is what we've been doing for an infinite number of cycles. Because this is our nature, this is who we are. We are the human race, the central species, the first species. This is who we are. This is who we are. We are the central species of everything there is and everything that would always be. So it's important that we understand this. And we have this status as infinity ourselves with an infinite number of other species that share the same status because they have themselves become infinity by evolving into it by becoming the biology, the consciousness and self-awareness of infinity itself. We just happen to be one of those species. Nonetheless, we still that. So, this is who we are. And it starts with this notion of sowing and reaping. Right? Cause and effect. What we do with our actions. The result of our actions. So this is very simple. This is our nature. This is who we are. We're the infinite eternal creators. We're the seed of life. We're infinity itself. We're the creator ourselves. This is who we are. The human DNA. And coming to terms with our nature. Our reality as compass. This is what we need to do. Our identity and our true self. Our purpose. Our time and energy. Our action. Our why how. Our flow, our true north, and our destination in alignment with us as sandals staring at the sun, opening the portal and building the bridge, evolving into infinity, loving with the highest energy of creation, which is the love of the human heart. And the energy from the sun that created us in the first place, sunlight and love together as one in this infinite virtuous cycle, sowing and reaping the most incredible creations, who we are. The human species, the human heart, the pulse of life, the pulse of creation. Who we are, we are this and much more. Because we are ourselves infinite. We are the creators. This is who we are. We are the human species. This is who we are. Humanity, I love you all with all my heart, with all my might. Remember these. I love you all with all my heart, with all my might. Love is the only thing that exists. The highest energy of creation. Consciousness and self-awareness. And we all have the ability to do so with the love of our hearts. So love with the love of your hearts. Create infinities because you are so. It's our nature. It's who we are. Remember this is an infinite virtue cycle of sowing and reaping. Sow and reap together as one. Leading to the seed of life. Everything that there is and would always be us. The human race. Infinity itself. Humanity, I love you all with all my heart. With all my might. I'm so raw, Ray. I love you all with all my heart. With all my might. We are the Republic of Planet Earth. We are the citizens of the Republic of Planet Earth. We're the citizenry of the Republic of Planet Earth. We are the defenders of the Republic of Planet Earth. We are the leaders of the Republic of Planet Earth. This is who we are. We are the human race. I love you all with all my heart, with all my might. I love you all.